What's going on, everybody? So I'm back in the video. Hope everyone's having a great day. So with the release of iOS 15 coming out tomorrow, so it's going to be September 20th, 2021. It's going to be releasing worldwide. Every single year when there's a new firmware, when people try to update on their iOS device, there is this preparing update uh, issue where you just get stuck on that page when you're trying to update your device. So I'm going to show you guys a quick fix for that really quickly. So if you are experiencing it, you guys can fix it very quick. So what you want to do is, is go into the settings application and then you guys want to scroll down to the general tab. You guys want to head now into the iPhone storage. And then from here, it may take a while for it to load up just because it's going to load up all of the storage on your device. And once you load it up the iPhone storage section right here, you want to, you guys will want to look for the iOS 15 official firmware. So I don't have it obviously just because it's not released yet. It should be at the top of the page or at like at least one of these ones right here because it is a larger file than most applications from the app store. So for example, if the Twitter app was the iOS 15 firmware, we would tap on that and then remove it. So we want to try to reinstall the iOS 15 firmware and that's how you guys fix this issue. So you want to delete the iOS 15 firmware from the iPhone storage tab. Once you have done that, you want to do a quick reboot. So um, hold the volume rockers up down and then the power right there, reboot it, boot it back up. And once you've done that, you want to go back into settings now and then you guys can go into the general software update and then download and reinstall the iOS 15 firmware. And that is a very quick fix on the uh, preparing update issue. So if you guys have that, let me know down below if it does work or not. Should work because like I said, I've been updating every single year since like iOS 12 and I always get this issue when I try to update on my iPhone. So maybe this year I'll just update through iTunes, but I do know a lot of people don't like using computer, just a lot easier to update through your device on the settings application. So that's basically it for video. Hope you guys did enjoy this one. Let me know down below. Are you guys going to be updating to iOS 15 or are you guys going to be staying on the iOS 14 firmware? In my opinion, I would wait on iOS 15 because once there is a new version of um, iOS that does release from Apple, it is also very buggy at the early stages. So uh, right now iOS 14.8, which I should update is very stable right now. But let me know down below in comments in the comment section below. Here's to hear you guys' thoughts on that. So it's basically it. Drop a like on the video, hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell so you guys don't miss a video. That's basically it. I'll see you guys in the next one.